Hi, welcome back. And now we're gonna start finally doing the templates. Um, okay. I don't like my stand very much, so I might have to do this over. Hold on. Where is my try the cuts a bit more because it wasn't dry when I did this and if the same goes for you you can do this easily even though when it's a bit drier it is <gasps> oh dry now you're so far too far don't ruin it Accentuate cuts even more. As you can see, I'm holding it at the bottom so I'm not pushing it too hard. And I'm just accentuating those pieces a bit more. There we go. And now I can start. Um, where are my Oh, there. Hold on, peeps. I still have leaves here. So many things. Sorry, 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 sorry. It's time to clean up here soon. Okay, now we can start. Okay, opening up my, oh my goodness, I can't close this now also because I did show you what I did with my bud because I didn't, how do you call that? Wait for it to dry, which I should have, but anyways, oops. Let's go. Let's start. Okay, get your bamboo skewers. Get your glue. We're gonna apply glue at the bottom. Also on the edge because we really want those templates to hug the pistol. I know there's a name for this. I still can't come up. If you know, please leave a comment. And let me know, I forgot the name. Just want to cut this really, really close. So I'm just still gonna, as you can see, make it more compact. And yes, your stamens are gonna be a bit bigger than mine. Mine is just small, but I didn't want to try this away, so I'm still gonna use it. Mine are just so tiny. I mean, yours bigger. Don't mind. I'm gonna layer it, not stack it. So I'm gonna apply it offset. Also applying here in the edge on the stamen, the tip, the bottom part. There you go. Attach it one by one. Offset. Layer, not stack. gonna do this really fast because this is really easy I hope my templates are dry I think they are <coughs> I like this one more I feel I have the temp I feel so tempted to create more We'll see. I might have to 
don't think I can fill that whole vase with just these flowers. I'm just going to get it. So I have um, kind of an indication of how much I need. Um, I'll get it after this is done. Because I said two, maybe I'll need three of each. Or maybe even more to create a really, really a full bouquet. And that will be working over time. Okay, now we have attached this. And my bud, this one is really not perfect. I really hate it. All the others are beautiful. It's just this one. I'm just, I'm just going to make it fluffy. It's going to separate the templates apart from each other gently. Make it fluffy. Yours is going to be bigger. Again, I made yours bigger. Okay, now we'll start with the first three templates. Remember those? Yep. Yep, 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 yep. We'll start with that one. We'll start with template number one. Plain glue here. Also at the this talon. Uh, just one side, one part. There. Touch it. Or you can all I do is apply glue here. Look. There. Because it will only attach where you apply glue. Remember that. And then this goes a bit up. And that's why we need to attach this to the stamen so it stays up a bit. And also your templates are a bit smaller. This one is really huge. I really made a mistake with the size. So yours is going to be like a bit smaller, like half a centimeter. Now we're gonna on the opposite side attach to this template. Um no wait. This template. Sorry, sorry, yeah, because we have to layer. There on the opposite side, straight the opposite of the previous one just like that. if I disappear don't worry I'm just applying glue I'll be back you will see the flowers again and again mine are really mine is really big it's too big I, so I made it smaller for you and then this oops this one Which side again? Let's see. Oh, yeah. Just the whites are so long. Half of it. Or more. No. I just want to cover a quarter of it goes underneath the previous one. See that? look like this but this one needs to be a bit flatter so I'm just gonna pull it backwards and this up okay okay and now we're just gonna attach all these one by one in the same order as we have provided them and we're gonna flatten them a bit as well it's just by doing this look hold it like that and push it like this because this my inspiration is like that okay start with the start where should I start that one that goes underneath here I 
patch. The first one, um, so it goes like this. Wait, did I do that right? Yeah, I did that right. You just want to see a quarter of it. See that? It's not too much. You can lift the stamina up. The stamina needs to lift it up. I know it's hard because now they're attached to this tavern and yeah. Next. This goes. This over a quarter over the so this is the one that we attached. Gonna attach it a bit, a quarter, like that, and flatten it. This needs to be flat, so put it backward there. So, gotta help the template. And that's how you create a layer. <clears throat> Don't worry about this time, and we'll fix that later when everything is done. Um, next one. I guess. Oh. Hold on, peeps. Let me check. Yes. Again, a quarter over the previous one. This one, this last that we did. If you lost, place it on half. This is the last one that we did, half of it. Like, half. There. I like the Mod Podge much more. Next. So this is the flower that we have. And if it's saggy, make sure it's attached properly and in place. There we go. This will be in between. There now there's a gap right here. Oh, chips. There. Just gonna put it there. Gonna fill that gap. position it. Oh my tummy. Flatten it again. Oh wait, it's on the other uh -huh. which one was it? I can't remember. No, it's right, it's right. It's this one. So next check this goes the other side go to the gap that's the gap there goes over this underneath it and then the last one we're gonna fill the gap completely And you know, if you can't follow, just add the way you feel like it. Just make sure it's layered. If you're having a time, a hard time following it, just, just layer it. It's okay. Sometimes it does move. Maybe I have to position it a bit. Ugh. So. And that's what you get. Very intricate looking flower. With lots of layers. 
you won't be able to achieve when you're just layering. I can see now that this is not filling the gap there. That Mod Podge helped a lot. Now we're going to this template. I'm gonna apply glue here and here on this side because we really want those. We want this template to stay up. Um, remember the first template, which is this one, right? That should be on the side. Uh, I'm gonna show you this to you when the wire is so long. So that's the side. Gonna be in the center, just like that. Lift it up. Press, press, press. Help the template. it the wire is just too long I'm so sorry I'm really struggling showing you because of the wire oh, look how pretty this one is it's already so much oops, better with my watch so much shinier I have the one that I have here I'm not gonna try it away I'm only using it not really happy with it but there's not much I can do I'm just gonna get uh, hold on excuse me I'm gonna clean this up a bit. And my fingers too, because it's covered with glue. I'm really having a hard time. Everything sticks to my finger. Even the dirt on my table. And I don't wanna make my flower dirty, so yeah. Pardon me. Thank you for your patience. It's a struggle sometimes working with glue, right? The last one. I'm going to play glue here and there. Attach it. And people are going to wonder how did you. Ah, it's so pretty. Ruffled all those. And then you say. Mesogigoria technique. Now we're gonna lift up, make it fluffy. All this talon. It's really flat. I'm just gonna use my hobby tweezer and lift some of those talon up. Pushing it up. See? It's working. And then don't touch it anymore. And also, press your templates downward, hold it upside down. Press it gently here. The shape so it stays up. And then don't touch it and let it dry. Yeah, much better. Look at this one without Mod Podge. And then this one. Like, so much more vibrant. I love this one more. Okay, now when your flower petals are still fluffy like this, we need to help them, my friends. Meaning, we have to apply glue on areas by looking at down and then on areas where you think it should attach it should help and then push it up again because like I said before it will only attach where we apply glue okay heat up your glue gun for the leaves I'm just gonna show you how to do it I'm gonna take it off again. I don't really don't want leaves for this one. 
You won't see it. Have you seen the shape of the petals, the flower, I mean? And if you're gonna make a bouquet, you're not gonna see it anyways. But maybe for some of you that are not planning to make a bouquet, um, I'll just add some. Floral tape. This is experienced, so I'm not going to show you how explicitly tell you explain how floral tape works. You should know if you're not. It's really very easy, though. And my wire is annoying. I need to flatten it. It's so long. Sometimes you don't even have to cover the whole thing because it's going to disappear in the vase anyways. Get this. Your leaves. Shape it. I'm using the other side of my bamboo skewer. There you go. some glue gun and measure where your for example but then this is the vase where your th sticks out and that's where you attach your flowers or uh, leaves I mean okay so for example it's here attach them there if you're gonna do use a planter and all the way at the bottom I might need more The origin me, they are all the way at the bottom. And that's why you won't see them anyways, because when you're buying this in a shop or whatever, flowers, the leaves that are in the water contaminates the water and oh my goodness. You'll get bacteria. The leaves will get sick. The flowers won't last long and that's why sometimes flowers don't even have leaves because every all the leaves that it's are in the water will be taken out because it's contaminated okay if you're struggling with leaves like mine oh my goodness i don't know why because <coughs> i've done this so many times You can see I'm not having fun with the leaves because my heart is not in it. <laughs> so, so try and try and try again. Glue on it around. There you go. There. That's one. Get floral tape. Just a piece. Secure it. That was my phone. I need to pick that up. Hold on, I'll be right back. That's my system. It could be important. Keep on watching. Oops, the last one. And this is my last tutorial for today because it's 6 p.m. already. I still have to cook. I still have to clean up the dishwasher. I still have to call. I have to, get to contact customer support for something that is really urgent. It's such a disaster. I wish I could tell you, but uh, so I I can tell you. 
so we did crypto I sold our crypto and then there was this I don't know this guy I don't know I, I mean oh he didn't pay so I didn't we didn't receive our money and um, yeah that's sad that's really really sad I don't, don't believe. so contacted customer support and we had to um, send our um, how do you call that bank accounts etc etc all those transactions that we haven't received the money but he can't even provide that he did pay because he is uh, is his excuse is that um, he closed his bank account and moved from Germany to Canada and he can't speak German he can't speak English yeah so it's uh, but and then we're just telling him that you know it doesn't matter that even if you close your bank you should be able still to um, contact the bank and ask for you you know all your transactions on paper everything digital I said no I don't have family living in Germany you don't have to because everything is digital these days you don't have to be present you have to you have to provide some information so that it's really you like your passport or questions that you have to answer etc and just all that alone is just saying that you just didn't complete now it's also my mistake to releasing it and trusting it ah oh, man anyways it's a lot of money it's about 2,500 400 euros that we lost. not all is mine by the way half of it is my brother's and I only did that is so um, uh, the crypto is so you know I could afford to go to what is it that's Croatia if I don't get that money then I won't be able to and that's also my savings from all the subscriptions for March and for two months subscriptions and some orders obviously because subscription is not much it's just I think 20 people or something I can't remember anyway so that's another problem hope you enjoyed making this one so that's why I'm a bit distracted now because I am also have to do those. This is the um, Shirley Poppy Happiness Miss Obigoria. I mean, isn't she a beauty? This flower would look pretty with Christmas too. You know, we always made the same poinsettias and everything. But why not use a different flower for Christmas? Why not? It is red, it is white, it is happiness. I mean, what else do you want for Christmas? Right? Layered. Oh! Pretty, 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 pretty. I do recommend using um, mud for making your shine. Yeah, it's gonna be less stiff and stuff. And um, on pictures, it would look real. In real life, it's gonna look very plasticky, but on the photo, it's gonna be so pretty on photos. I promise. It's a different flower, not the amazing green, and um, so yeah, the effect will be differently. But I just wanna, I'm not sure, the amazing green and this poppy doesn't look good in a bouquet, so I'm not sure what I'm gonna do. Anyways, that was it. Thank you so much. Follow me on Instagram, subscribe to my YouTube channel, sharing it on Instagram. Please tag me so I can see your creations. Uh, follow my Facebook page, leave a review on my Facebook page. Thank you so much. And um, follow my group. I've uh, already mentioned you that. Uh, join our group. Thank you. And if you got this from Etsy, please consider heading back to my Etsy so I can leave a review. When sharing it on Facebook and other groups you are in, um, you can mention where you got the file from. You don't have to mention my name. You can mention the file name and then Etsy. That's it. Thank you so much. Enjoy making your flower and looking forward to seeing you in the next few tutorial or in our Facebook group or on Instagram. Thank you. Ciao.